Hello friends, welcome back to a new video. Today I'll be reading to you Canada in Words. Um, the reason I am reading um, a book about Canada is because today is Canada Day. And um, this is like a different kind of book. This is a special book. So um, it's not like the regular series books I read or those other books. Um, this is like... A Canada book. So um let's get straight into this book. Um Canada in words. So I'll read you. Uh this is a map of Canada. This is Yukon Territory, Northwest Territories, none of it. So these are the three territories. Um British Columbia, Alberta, Saskatchewan, Manitoba, Ontario. Quebec, New Brunswick, Nova Scotia, Prince Edward Island, and Newfoundland and Labrador. So these are the provinces. So um, before I used to live in uh, Alberta, then um, we went to visit our cousins in Saskatchewan. Then uh, we went through Manitoba and we came here in Ontario. Um, the places I have visit are mostly Alberta, Saskatchewan, Manitoba, and Ontario. Um, there's also uh, Canada's biggest Canada's biggest uh, city is Toronto. It's, it is in Ontario. Um, and um, the yeah, that's that's mostly it. And um. Yeah, and these three territories you can see, and the ones they used to be one, they weren't like three, so, yeah. So this is a beaver, um, because you you'll be seeing there's only like one word on each page. It is because, um, there's one word on each page, but I will explain why they're showing it. So, a beaver is because. It's Canada's national animal. A canoe was invented by the First Nations a very long time ago, and people still use it today. Um, totem pole. The the First Nations they used to make these statues, and people go come to see them sometimes. Grizzly bear is an animal that lives in Canada. Um, maple syrup is one of our most um known like it's like a thing that we use all the time maple syrup um it's um it's a syrup you can use it on pancakes and stuff um well um almost like everyone everyone in canada w would know about maple syrup and they have tried it before in their life life and there's also this um recipe um where they uh freeze uh maple syrup and eat it it's cold, so yeah. Sugar shack is where um they they call they add little tubes into the maple uh, trees and they the tube um then they add a little bucket underneath and then the maple syrup drips uh, into the bucket. Um, ice fishing, um people. Uh, because it's very cold, people make little holes in the ice and they um, fish inside. Took is because I just mentioned on the other page. It's very cold and um, you need a hat or else or took um, for the cold weather. Long johns. It's a very like it's um it's it's not like um. A shirt and a pant is just one whole thing, so um, you can wear it in the winter. Um, snowshoes, they're these um, net kind shoes. You um, and they you strap it onto your feet, and they're very easy to use um, when it's very snowy. Mostly in the northern parts of Canada. Um, lobster. Well, you can find in the um, beach. Uh, schooner, just um, a boat where people ride on. Hockey is um, 
is our uh, is a game that Canadians invented. Stanley Cup is um, a hockey match. Polar bears are um, also animals that you can find. Uh, polar bears you find them in the northern parts of Canada. Um, Inukshuk. Um, the people who lived in the northern parts of Canada, like the first settlers, they made Inukshuks to guide the way because before there weren't like street signs and stuff. So they used, um, they made this Inukshuk out of, um, rocks to guide the way for people. Um, log cabin people make these mostly in the wilderness, so, um, they live there. Blueberries. I really don't know my blueberries. Um, you can pick them. <laughs> Lacrosse is also another game uh, people play. It's with a net, and um, you throw the ball through the net. And it's basically almost like hockey. Instead, um, you play it in the summertime. Um, and instead, there's a, uh, instead of a hockey stick, you use this stick with a net on it. And there's like a ball that you have to throw up in the air, not on the ground. Maple leaves are the leaves on maple trees. Lakes, there are, I think there are four great lakes in Canada. A loon is um, sort of a, a duck. No, it's an animal and it lives in the water. Poutine is, um, um, it's almost like french fries, so it's like more thick and you put, um, and if some of you must know New York fries, you put a bunch of, um, toppings on it. Um, Chewbacca, there's, um, it's just go sliding down. Okay. Um, prairies, um, are m are um, basically just um, flat land, mostly in Saskatchewan. Oh, yeah, never mind. Okay, so there, um, these people, they're, um, the royal um canadian police people they ride on horses and stuff and they we wear these kind of um what do you call it? these suits um mountains um there there are many mountains in canada um uh, salmon a fish um you find in lakes or rivers um very common Bush plane. It's it's just a type of plane that's very old, but you won't see them now. Northern Lights. Um, where once um when I lived in um Ed, Edmonton in um Alberta, um we we saw this like uh, green lights just going through the sky, and we weren't sure if they were Northern Lights. We saw it a few times, then we started we. Started thinking that maybe there were northern lights because they're called northern lights because they're found mostly in the north, and it's not just green the color. There are many colors of it. I know even in the picture they're showing like green, blue, and stuff. So, and yeah, that's basically the end of the book. Um, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.